Good morning. Good morning. It's great to stay up late. Good morning. Good morning to you and you and you and you. What is up, you guys? Oh my gosh. Welcome to the Sedona vlog. Oh, I'm so excited, you guys. I am gonna be exploring a little bit of Sedona today. I have a long weekend and I'm gonna be going with my friend Eileen. You guys are probably gonna get to meet her a little later. I'm excited. I'm so excited. It is my first time ever going to Sedona. And one thing about me is I'm gonna go somewhere and I'm gonna explore, okay? We have a whole itinerary that she actually put together and I'm excited to really just follow it because normally I'm like the friend that puts things together and puts the itinerary together. Between Ashley and myself, we're normally the ones that put the itinerary together and then everyone else just kind of tags along and yeah it's kind of nice to be pampered in this way to be honest with you so i was like super grateful and i told her like thank you so much for setting this whole thing up so sedona is about two hours from phoenix i'm gonna be putting my hair up because we're gonna be doing the pink jeep tour so y'all better stay y'all better stay to like see everything that we do i'm so excited i am so excited from what i hear you didn't go to Sedona if you didn't do a pink tour, okay? <laughs> but I'm just kidding because a lot of you guys are going to be like, well, you didn't go to Sedona if you don't go hiking. And I'm not going hiking. <laughs> I am not going hiking, but we have a full-on itinerary. Today, I will be breaking my fast a little bit earlier. So I'm going to be breaking my fast at around 10 a.m. I'm going to be on my way to pick her up. We're going to be driving to Sedona. And I'm excited. I am so, so, so excited. I have already two months here in Arizona and look at the things that I'm already starting to do. The weather is gonna be beautiful out there. It's gonna be 84 degrees in the highs and then I think it'll go down, if anything, to like 56 or whatnot. So that's beautiful, beautiful weather. I'm excited to try like the little cafecito spots and to try just to see what's out there. Obviously the views, which is the most important thing ever. Nature, 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 nature. And I do hear there's like this prayer place where like people go and like meditate and pray and like just kind of sit with their feelings and stuff. And I'm like, ooh, like that's exciting. Just to like see, you know, you guys know I'm a traveler. I love, love, love to see different things and see different staples in every country and every state. And I'm excited. I'm excited because I feel like every culture has something, you know, to offer. And when you're just open to learning about them and just kind of being there in the moment, like that's really nice, you know. So I love that. You guys know I love me some good food. <laughs> so I'm excited to also go do that. I'm doing my hair now. I've done my makeup, which by the way... I posted the makeup routine already by the time you guys watch this on TikTok. And I also have all of the products tagged on my LTK. You guys always, always, always ask me about my lipstick. And it's so funny because if you're watching Love is Blind, Hannah went like a viral because of the kiss that she did with her man or whatever. I forgot his name. And she was wearing the red shade of the same brand and the same lipstick that I wear. So I was like, I gotta go get the red one. <laughs> <laughs> literally i was like oh now i gotta go get the red one so yeah i'm excited i was gonna do i was gonna do like a whole on little thing to my ponytail but i actually kind of like how this looks so i think i'm just gonna leave it like that at first i was like oh like i'm gonna shower like i did shower <laughs> i did shower okay but at first i was like oh i'm gonna wash my hair and you know like put my hair down and it'll be cute. But then after I'm like, we're doing the Jeep tour and the Jeep tour is supposed to be like, you know, which that reminds me, let me see if I have Dramamine because I don't tend to want to throw up, but you never know. And when I went to Dubai, we ended up getting on the sand dunes on the truck and the way that the guy was driving, it was just not good. So I was like almost throwing up. I didn't, but I ended up almost throwing up. <laughs> 
<laughs> so yeah, I am looking really cute. I'm wearing my Pandora necklace. Remember you guys, I told you guys about it and then I added this pendant for now. Tell me why ever since I moved and I'm gonna be putting, I'm gonna be putting my Pandora bracelet too. I've been loving it. I've been getting a lot of compliments on it as well. And honestly, I have been loving like this combination of these two. So tell me why, tell me why ain't nothing but a heartbreak cancelado. Ain't nothing but a mistake, tell me why I never want to see your face. I don't even know who y'all talking about, but uh, I don't even think that's what it says either. <laughs> Luckily, I don't have anybody's face that I don't ever want to see, you know, like I really don't feel like that towards anybody Like I'm like if I see you cool if I don't see you cool either like it is what it is We move on life goes on <laughs> I'm excited. So I'm excited. I'm excited I'm excited I'm thrilled. I don't want to hear anybody count how many times Amy said excited. I'm excited count it again There's another one <laughs> Just kidding, you guys. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. That was the Red Robin commercial, by the way. Let me figure out, should I wear a little ribbon? It's gonna be cute, it's gonna be cute. Let me show you guys my outfit. So you guys kind of see, like, let me figure out my shoes. How about that? All right, I put on my shoes. Let's put on some perfume. One thing about me is I'm gonna smell good. I'm gonna smell good, I don't care. I do not care. I have enough to go all over. <laughs> Yeah, al rato compro otro, it's okay. Baby, abundance, okay? I am not about to not use my perfumes because you should only put one, two, and three, baby. Y'all already know me. But anyways, I'm gonna put on my rings. Sometimes I get overstimulated and I'm like, take off all the rings. And then other times I'm like, I miss how my hands look with the rings. Like jewelry just kind of brings your outfit together, you know? And I am gonna put on, I put on, I put on for my city, on, on for my city. I know, I know, I know. I'm a radio station and I just think of a song and I just, you know, I put on for my city, on, on for my city, I put on for my city. Anyways, anyways, I'm looking cute. <laughs> Yes, so I am wearing this top that I got off of Amazon and then I am wearing these cargo pants that you guys can't like fully see. I'm gonna try to see if I can show you over there. Con mis tenis that I, <laughs> let me put you guys lower. That might be better. Okay, so I'm wearing these cargo pants that I got from Sheen and then I'm wearing my shoes. Y'all see the vibe? Okay, and then I'm gonna be putting on this it's fall, baby. It's time. It's time for Dodger baseball. I put on for my city, on, on for my city. Yeah, this is cute. And as far as the bag goes, I'm gonna wear my base. Yeah, let me show you guys since this is actually a really good look. You guys have seen this bag before. It's really cute, but it's a vibe. It's a vibe. She wanna vibe. It's a vibe, she wanna vibe. Yeah, so this one you can wear in multiple ways, like you can wear it like this. It's really cute, okay, Amy. You're looking cute or whatever, what's up? It's really, really good. I'm excited, I'm excited, because I'm going somewhere new, I'm excited because I'm gonna have a full day in Sedona full of activities with good food, with good company, with good views. Oh, I'm so excited for the views. I am so excited for the views, you guys. I had been waiting <laughs> to go to Sedona for a long time. I've actually never made it out to the Grand Canyon either, and eventually I will. But now that the weather is changing, like there's so many great things that I get to do. Um, so many people are telling me like so many places to visit. Arizona has a lot of gems, okay? A lot of gems. I also believe that if you're looking for a party, it ain't no party like LA party. So you can't compare it, okay? <laughs> but if you're looking for views, for rest, for ooh, go within, free chill, which by the way, 
this is the day after I went to the yoga class and the yoga class was amazing as I told you guys in the last vlog. Tell me why. Yes, I feel a little bit sore, but I don't feel like I would have felt had I not taken that yin yoga class. That was amazing and you know, when you look good, when you feel good, like baby, who can take you down right now? Nobody. I'm like <laughs> I'm excited, I'm excited. And I hope you guys can feel it through the screen because I am, I really am. I'm so happy that I can get, I'm, I am so happy that I get to do this. I'm so happy that I am finding new connections and that I am finding new friendships and that I'm finding new people and that people are just literally like, hey, do you wanna do this? Hey, let's go here, hey, let's hang out. I am so happy that that is happening for me I was talking to a friend yesterday and she was like, Amy, like I'm seeing your videos, I'm seeing, you know, just everything and there's a completely new light from you. And I'm like, honestly, sometimes a flower <laughs> won't grow. Sometimes a flower won't flourish unless we change its environment. And I just felt like my time where I was, was done with. And I'm like, I would like something new, God lead the way. And then I sought the Lord and he heard and he answered and here I am and yeah, there is literally shine lining through me and I'm very happy that you guys get to see it shine and that you guys get to come with me on this beautiful journey. So let me get my water ready. Let's go right, to the I have my water ready and honestly, I have no electrolytes right now here at the house. Like I normally drink coconut water. And when I went to Costco, I don't know why I didn't think of getting coconut water. So I am probably gonna stop to put gas right now and also to get a coconut water because your girl needs some electrolytes. I, I'm cute. I'm cute. Ah, I love it. I love when I feel this good because I'm really excited. I'm really super excited. So I have my purse. I have my water and what else? And that's all I need. Oh, I should take some glasses. I put on for my city, on, on for my city. Should I put these on? I put on, I put on. <laughs> yeah, these are it. I love these glasses for everything. They're a vibe. They're a vibe. She want a vibe. They're a vibe. You guys already know. Isn't it me? I guess so. I'm working late because I'm a singer. Oh, you look so good. I don't even know the lyrics to songs anymore. Like... <laughs> That's funny. I'll just be like, I'll just know like the little TikTok part of the songs now, you know, like baddies pose for me. As fat, slim, thick, no tummy. I'm too bad and I'm getting more money. Yep. You already know the vibes. Yeah. So, all right. We got the shades. We got the glasses. We got, we got everything we need. Talking about Willis. All right, let's go. Eat. Oh, 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 oh. So talking about everything we need, I definitely need my portable charger because I haven't bought like a car charger for my new phone and it's not the same charger that I had before, obviously. So now I'm like, I need to carry this with me at all times, especially since we're going long ways. Um, thankfully, obviously my friend Eileen has her phone too. And then, you know, so we should be good. Guys, I made it to put gas and you know what haunts me? I just seen this tall man and he was like slouching over and I'm like Why do some men just overall or even women I guess like Why if you're that tall do you walk with your back slouched over? I don't know if it's a thing but I had a tia in our family who like anytime we would walk like slouched over she'd go like right in the middle of our back and like just do this so that we could like that we could like stand up super straight <laughs> it was really funny but i like now like every time i see someone doing that i just want to do that to like their back so that they can you know stand up straight obviously i'm not talking about anybody who may have some sort of condition so please don't come for me because i'm saying that i'm just simply saying a lot of people have beautiful height 
and they're so afraid or maybe not confident to like show their height especially men like do you know how many men would love to have your height and don't and then it's very attractive to me obviously when there's a man who like is tall and stand up straight because i could tell that not just he loves being tall but also like he's proud of it you it know it's 54 85 as you guys see la would never we got the goods i ended up going you guys for some for some gatorade i was like i looked for coconut water and i did end up buying one because eileen i you know texted her and i was like hey i'm stopping by would you like anything she was like oh yeah coconut water but here where i'm at i guess all they have is this type of coconut water which i like to just drink pure coconut water like no sugar added no nothing else added because if not like what's the point so i'm like if i'm gonna drink sugar i might as well just get some electrolytes with some gatorade <laughs> So I I got two Gatorades um, just in case she also wants one. And then I got coconut water and now we're on our way to her house. Ah! I'm excited because I'm probably gonna see you guys until we get to Sedona or like show you guys the views. <sighs> Thank you for coming along with me because this is amazing and super exciting. We're at the pump house. This is Eileen. Hi. I was telling you guys about my friend Eileen. She is gonna be taking me everywhere to Sedona. So what's the itinerary today? Okay, so we're at the pump house right now, grabbing breakfast slash brunch because we gotta bring her to a good spot. You yes. Know. <laughs> uh, we're gonna do a Jeep tour, a pink Jeep tour. So she can, yeah, we're gonna go to the pink Jeep tour. After I wanna go to the Peace Park. <clears throat> the peace park go to downtown sedona to get some ice cream and then see the sunset yay uh, you're speaking my language girl you're speaking my language so we're gonna take you guys through everything that we're doing today so exciting but first food y cafecito right yes yay <laughs> let's try it It's good. Yeah, it's good because it's not overly sweet. I love that. I love when coffee's not overly sweet. Already a vibe. God, amen. Yes, guys. Oh, that looks so cute. Like with the background. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's try it. First, I want to try the biscuits and gravy. This looks amazing, you guys. Let's see. Ooh, it's hot. <laughs> I need a little bit of pepper. Mm. Oh my gosh, the biscuit. You're gonna love it, girl. The biscuit is so good. Mm. Oh my goodness. This is so good. Okay, already approved. Now we're gonna try the potatoes. Let's see. They're cooked to perfection. Very good. And then let's try the chorizo. You guys know I love chorizo. I just want to try a small bite of the chorizo. Mm. Oh, this is good. I love it. Let's eat. <laughs> How did I do, Amy? We, we fit the good breakfast spot? Yes, thank you. You did amazing. I love this. Corazón contento, you guys. I can't see because of the sun. <laughs> Pero we are going now. Where are we going? Telakepaque. Telakepaque. Oh, telak. Telakepaque. I'm like, wait, what? I can speak <laughs> Spanish, okay? <laughs> we are going to Telakepaque. A ver, a ver qué vamos a ver. But we need to walk this food out. Go see this fountain, you guys. Look at all the pumpkins. Oh. Oh.
made it to the chai spot and we're sitting like off of this little thing right here. It's really nice. There's a chapel right here. This is so beautiful. So, so beautiful. Even like the vibe is very like super hippie. <laughs> Super hippie, y alguien estaba fumando aquí marihuana por, por algunos lados, pero se ve super nice. I love it. I love it. People are chilling. This is a vibe. Thank you. <laughs> We got our little Thai tea. What did you get? A chai tea. A chai, tea. chai tea. Period. And uh, now we're going back because we're gonna go to the pink Jeep tour. I'm excited. I'm excited. It's gonna be super cute. Actually made it. Y'all, we had to like yeah, walk yeah. super fast. <laughs> Cause we're like, it's almost 12. But we found parking a little bit further than normal. So that's fine. Let's, let's get it. We got a self check in. In the Coyote Canyon store today. And. They <laughs> <laughs> got 10 people in that thing. <laughs> First stop, and she is doing amazing by taking all of our pictures. First of all, love it. It's gonna be like you. How are you feeling? Super padre. I love this. It's a vibe. It's so peaceful. The aura, the everything. I'm like, I'm healing 100%. Not that I was hurt about anything, but still, you know, like it's just one of those things where you feel refreshed. You can breathe. made it to Slide Rock, you guys. Whew. It's so pretty here. Mande? Se echó un clavado. I know that's right, sir. <laughs> Con su. We're gonna go touch the water, you guys. A ver qué tan fría it's pretty cold. Oh, it is cold. Oh yeah, it's definitely cold. I would not get in here right now. <laughs> it's like the ocean water in LA, but except it feels like spring water. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. <laughs> you guys, this has been such a peaceful experience. What is this called again? Slide Rock. Slide Rock. Slide Rock is a place to come if you're trying to freshen up. If you want to come and bring your kids, it's really cute. It's really cool to see adults become kids themselves because there's like a literally like a natural slide here that you can go on and like the adults are like, woo! <laughs> like if you're on a roller coaster, you know? So it's been amazing. Now we're gonna go and have some lunch. Oh no. You didn't play with Laimi?
Amy, where are we? We are at the Indian Gardens Oak Creek Market. Vamos a comer. What are we getting, Amy? We're getting a blueberry vanilla matcha. <laughs> I'm like, let's see. Vamos a probar. Yes. I see why it's so popular. Oh my gosh. Vamos a sentarnos now that we got our matcha. How are you feeling? First of all, we couldn't make it to that lunch spot because they didn't have lunch anymore, but we had lunch somewhere else. And look at this beautiful view. The sunset here? Yeah. A completely different story than anywhere else. This is amazing. I'm so grateful. So, so grateful to be here. I'm so happy that I finally made it to out to Sedona. Yay! Guys, now we're going to get some ice cream. We're at Sabrina's. Is this Sabrina's call? I don't know what the name of this is, but it says Sabrina's favorite up there. I'm excited. Oh yeah, it's Sabrina's Gourmet Ice Cream. <laughs> so I went for butter pecan and extreme brownie. Delicious. I tried both of them before actually like ordering it. It's amazing. <laughs> you guys, I have officially made it home. I showered, I washed my hair. My face is feeling a little bit dry. My lips are a little bit dry, but they've been dry because the weather is definitely changing already. So let's moisturize. Wow, what a beautiful day in Sedona. That was truly amazing. That was truly an experience. I really feel like I can hang out in Sedona for like two weeks straight and just like take in all the nature and everything beautiful in there like the views the sky the food the people the tours the history like it was amazing the fact that only 10,000 people live there and there's over a million people who visit yearly like I literally was surrounded by people from all over the world and one of the best things that I enjoy doing so much is like people watching but man, like all the great pictures and content that I was able to get you guys and I've got to bring you guys along with me. That's amazing because since I was about like 19 years old, I've been saying that I wanted to go to Sedona. I've been saying that I wanted to go to the Grand Canyon. I still haven't made it out to the Grand Canyon, but today, finally, at 30 years old, I made it out to Sedona and that was amazing. Like that was so, so good. I'm really happy that we got to do a bunch of cool things um, where we were gonna have lunch. Like they ended up, they don't serve lunch, I think after like 3 p.m. So we were a little bit late, but we got to try their matcha and it was the best matcha that I have had anywhere. Like it was perfect, 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 perfect. And I literally would just go back for that matcha. So such a sun day trip, such a sun day trip. I definitely will do it again very very soon i don't know when exactly i have so many things that i want to do here in arizona but i love that i'm exploring and i love that i get to bring you guys along to it so i'm gonna leave this video here because i just wanted to bring you guys along to just sedona i don't know how long this video is gonna end up being but i hope you guys loved it i hope you love that i got to bring you with me and all of my adventures today eileen if you're watching this thank you so so much like you're so good at recording everything i'm so not used to having someone want to record for me like 24 7 like that and eileen was just so willing to like just be like, do you want content here? Do you want content there? Like, do you tell me where? And I'm like, you are so good at what you do. Like, that's her job, actually. Like, she's a social media manager for, like, food businesses or, like, just for businesses overall. And I'm like, you are amazing at what you do. Like, 
this is crazy and i love it like it was amazing to have that it was an amazing day with the girlfriend it was amazing to like just chit chat and like do a bunch of things one of these days i'm gonna go back and like really go out there on a hike and really get to explore more things Sedona is one of those places that I feel like it's so close to here that I'm willing to take that drive for more day trips more often. You know, it's like a it's like a super close getaway that a lot of like I wouldn't have anywhere else unless I was here and I got to experience it so so beautiful today. So I hope you guys got to enjoy it as well. Let me know down below where else I should go. Like where else is it good to take a day trip that's close to Phoenix? Let me know. I'm excited. I'm excited to continue to explore and to get to know more people and just to like continue to live life, you know, and bring you guys along with me. I'm gonna leave you guys here. I love you. Thank you for coming with me. Until the next one. Bye.